Hey peeps, Scouts Mice here, back with my blind playthrough of Lost Odyssey. We are definitely on this too, because Max in my team, and he wasn't in before. Um, he is in the front row. I don't know if that means he's an immortal, or they just think he is someone more inclined to physical attacks, and therefore, kind of, he belongs in the front. I don't know. Might as well give him a ring. I need to make some more rings, actually. I, I need to kind of spice up my ring selection, because, um... Yeah, I just do. Um, let's stop him being paralyzed. I don't know. I don't even think I've given anything to... I haven't given a ring to you because I haven't even got one. So let's make a ring quick. Something that Cook would like. So something magic -y. Nah, do you know what? I think probably the osmosis thing. Even though she doesn't do physical attacks that often, it's probably the best of... the best thing I can give her. You know, if she's ever low on magic attacks, then she, you know, if she if she was ever like super low on magic points, then we could always um, get her to attack for a couple of turns and bam. Yeah, it's weird the whole disc thing. I reckon it must have been like maybe you only have to put the disc in. The, maybe you only have to put disc two in just for a mi just for a second, just so it kind of registers that you have got it. I don't know. Mac, are you getting all strange again? Be okay, Mac. Calm down. Your power won't do bad things anymore. What? His you power? This? A power. It's weird. This strange power is moving inside of me. That's the magic of the Eastern Tribe. Don't worry about it. The Eastern Tribe coexists with the forest. They both respect and fear it. They revere and live so closely with the forest that they gain special powers from it. Isn't the Eastern Tribe the people who started the war 500 years ago? Shut up, you, Jensen. <laughs> I've got a tablet of the Eastern Tribe. I got it last time. You were possessed by the Crimson Forest, which still holds the remnants of the Eastern Tribe's spirit. Because of that, the power of the Eastern Tribe now resides uh -huh. within you, Mac. Ooh, seems like a mixed blessing to me. That's not true. I'm <laughs> sure it'll come in handy. You should be thankful, Mac. Good for you, Mac. <laughs> I wish I could get it. You don't suppose the Crimson Forest would possess me too, would it? <laughs> right. I don't know where I'm going. I'm hoping the game is going to kind of tell me at some point. I'm sure it will. Back to Nomura, probably. And then maybe some shenanigans are going to go on when we get there. Hello. What the hell are you? Oh, what's this? It wasn't like this before. Ah, maybe because Max here. Me? Seems so. There's a powerful spirit magic at work in this forest. It's likely that everything's coming back to life due to a spirit mage like Mac being here. How neat! Let's see if these things are working then. Let's see if what things are working. Who's that? Does that mean I'm gonna not have to fight any enemies, maybe? I still don't know what these crystal fragments are for. What is this? What are you? Where will you take me? Okay. This is new territory. I don't know if we're just collecting, like... Oh! What have we unleashed? <laughs> Go on, Mac. Five of us now. Things, uh, the odds are starting to go in our favor a little bit. Okay, so I remember these guys from last episode. I'm pretty sure that we can kill each one with just one... Like, they're weak to water. And I'm pretty sure that just one casting of water is enough to kill them. Ah, finally we can do spirit stuff. Okay, so the shadow inflicts low non low non elemental damage on all enemies, just like the treat the obsidian thing was doing. Oh wow, and that only takes one turn, because Jansen's thing that attacks everyone takes two turns. Slightly increases the physical attack of one party member, or slightly increases the magical attack of one party member. That's quite nice. Um, what skills has he got? Inflicts a powerful and damaging attack on one enemy consecutively 
attacks one enemy twice in a row or slightly increases GC of the front row. That's quite nice. I like the, um, let's just go for a double hit. Um, because I don't, I don't know. Actually, that was probably an excessive amount of health uh, magic points I've used there on that spell, but whatever. Um, I thought it was a bit overkill to do a spell that attacks everyone, so that by the time it gets around to his turn, everyone will be dead anyway. Um, or almost everyone. See, look at this. Going down in one hit. These are the kind of enemies I like. <laughs> None of this like, hey, I'm going to knock off 90% of your health in one hit. Right, I reckon if we just get the physical people attacking the soul eater bug, the magical people attacking the fire things, Aqua on you. I'm not. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with you, Mac. Yet, I'm not quite sure. He hasn't got a whole heap of magic points, to be honest. Now let's just go with Shadow. Shadow's the lowest magic point thing that he has, which is quite good. So you know, for quite a low amount of magic points, we can attack everyone in only and it only takes one turn. It's pretty sweet. Bum, ba -bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Boom! Now it's five against one. Is it five against none? Shadow. It's pretty decent. Still not dead, but pretty decent. Oh, I'm just going to tell everyone to attack. I'm sure just a round of physical attacks has got to be enough to get... Ooh. Oh, of course it's damage up because her sword is fire. Sweet. And that was a wind... Time lane, concentrate, set lane, concentrate, back lane, counter, counter. Now that sounds, that if that does what it sounds like it does, then that is pretty tasty. Randomly performs a counter attack against the enemy's regular attack. Yes, so yeah, so I, I guess not 100% of the time, but he's gonna counter attack at random moments, which is pretty sweet. Can I learn that? Oh yes, I can learn it. We're definitely getting both people, both immortals are learning that ASAP. We also can learn spirit magic from them as well, which is pretty sweet. Um, can I get Mac to learn? I can't get, okay. I can't get him to learn like black magic or whatever. Oh, actually, that's not true. I think some of the things that I can give him. Like, that enables level 1 black and white. I think I might give him that. Yeah, yeah. I'll give him that, because then it kind of... Uh, just as a backup, he can do, like, basic fire... Basic, you know, basic magic attacks, and he can also do... Um... What was the point in coming here? I came up here, kicked open a rock, which released an enemy, and gave me no items and no way forward, and it was a complete waste of time. Whatever. Yeah, at least now, as a backup, he can be he can heal just in case he needs to, or... Um, yeah, it's handy, it's handy. Kelolon! <laughs> Let's get a Zeph. No, no, in fact, Zeph is overkill. It's only really Kaim that hasn't got full health. You can do... Um, let's do Prism, actually, because that'll attack everyone. And you can do Shadow, because that'll attack everyone, because it's quite a lot of enemies about. Hey, yeah! Oh, wow. Okay, okay no, I thought I killed him in one shot there. I was going to say, maybe these are weaker than I thought. Oh, sweet little counter there, Mac. I'm liking Mac already. Bum, 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 bum. I mean, I assume I've just got to. I don't know where I'm going, but I assume I've just got to get out of here. I don't remember there being alternative like paths. I don't remember there being two different ways I could go in the in the forest. So, like I think there was just one way in, one way out. So, I guess time will tell. Actually, no. You'll need to. Oh, actually, yeah. Let's steal. Why not? Um, yeah, you continue your prism. You continue your shadow. 
It seems like, I mean, unless you're like in a real emergency and need to do something else, it seems like you'd never, you'd never not continue. Especially with a move that takes two turns to do, because it's like, you've already committed then, I mean, you've already wasted one turn. If you cancel it, then you've, you've wasted that turn for nothing. Reinforcements have arrived! Oh, damn it. <laughs> Get out of here! Who are you? I will steal from you some healing medicine. I did that just for the sake of it. I, like, just because I always forget to steal. Maybe I should, um... I should have stole against the boss, to be honest. It's always... The, it, I always forget the bosses are the one time where you should steal, and it's the one time I always forget to steal, because... Um... Of just, like... The panic of being like, oh my god, it's a boss, I'm gonna die if I don't constantly heal myself. And like, you know, it's like, I don't wanna, I often am scared to take a turn off either attacking or healing myself because I might die. Hmm. Heal! Who are you healing, buddy? Is he healed himself? Oh yeah! Take some of that. Duff man! Right, I think I'm just gonna kind of cut to me getting out of here. It, assuming that nothing comes up, I'm just gonna cut to me kind of getting out the forest, because I assume that's all I've got to do. And then, yes. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the forest and um, got loads of these seeds, man. Seeds for days. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna see what... I'm gonna go somewhere, and if something happens, we'll cut back to that. Whew, well, that was a longer one and a bit more... a bit of a weird one. Um, so it was all about, like... The city of Nobara. Okay, it's telling me to go there. Um, it was all about a time when Kaim was almost working as, like, a pirate. Well, not a pirate. He was working aboard a boat. Um, he was a... he's a sweet... I can't remember. Port swing, whatever the word, you know, he was helping out on a boat, and um, they were heading off to like this island to do research on this this island that was once kind of they used to sing elegies whenever someone died, so they'd sing like a, a song to kind of commemorate the passing of anyone, um, and and then this army, which we don't really know, we didn't give didn't really give much details about, this army came in to just kind of completely annihilate the town um, and not even you know they they it wasn't even done I don't know I mean how can you humanely annihilate a town but you know what I mean like it was done brutally they butchered and tortured and you know killed everyone in sight oh uh, beloved citizens of Korra, I am Tolton son of the late King Cypher please heed my words at this moment Oh, if it isn't that little scamp from Ura. <laughs> it's the council. I wonder what's going on. Mm, what would be so important that they'd have to broadcast it around the world? On the Wall Islands into such a tragedy. I am overwhelmed with shame at the number of people who died in that battle. Furthermore, I must inform the people that His Excellency, the Venerable Chairman Roxian, who has led the council since our nation became a republic, has passed away due huh? to a sudden hmm. illness. Yeah. His Excellency hmm. Big Snake Itis. Do you understand any of this? There were a lot of words I heard in my history class. That to save Ura, the monarchy must be restored immediately. Therefore, in accordance with His Excellency's dying wish, I hereby declare that henceforth the Republic shall be abolished. What? And the Council shall be dissolved. Does he have the power oh, to do that? Are sure taking a lot of initiative there? <laughs> it's Gongora's plotting. The boss? I don't get it. They're trying to stop something, right? I, as the first in line to the throne, shall, with honor, bear the crown as 45th King of Ura. Also, oh, 45. Oh, thanks for clearing it up. I thought you were 44. <laughs> I shall appoint His Excellency Gongora, no. a sorcerer of vast experience, as my royal advisor and second in command. <sighs> well, it shall be a great honor to accept Your Majesty's appointment. 
Scumbag. He sure knows how to ham it up. <laughs> what did did he just say royal advisor? He's kidding, right? It's nothing but government by regent. My beloved citizens, allow me to illustrate one of the reasons that I reached this difficult decision. Huh? It's me! Look it! They must be planning to invade Dura. Is that the voice? What is this? How should I know? As you can see, it has been refitted with weapons. Do you understand what this means? Numara, like Kent before it, is bearing its aggressive Dear. fangs at our country. In this time of crisis, our country no longer has a standing Why army to protect us. Our army was swept up in the devastation at the Wall Island. It is in times like these when a king who can lead Ura to victory, like my late father, is indispensable. Jansen, what the hell is this? Explain yourself. I'm telling you, I don't know anything. You've been used. Me? By Gungora? You gotta be kidding me. I was just in it for the money. There, see? <laughs> he let it slip. Yeah, okay. So now you know. But all he asked me to do is keep an eye on you guys. You gotta believe me. Then what was that black pearl all about? Mm. Well, look, that, that was, uh, well... Kaim, that, this uh, guy's bad news. Uh, we should get rid of him. We need to deal with him before we look for Sarah. Gungara might even be listening in on this conversation. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Okay, you don't know the whole story. Let me it just. It doesn't matter. Kaim? Let him hear us. Let him see us. Let him shudder as we close in on him. Ew. You are creeping me out. Man, you know, he's a handful even after getting his memories back. Where did I put that pearl? Hmm. So yeah, they've gone from being like a, you know, a nice, well, I say nice, you know, they've gone from kind of, you know, you know, a republic where they've got a council of people and people making decisions as a collective. Oh, what? The shop will not open. Um, yeah. There are a bunch of soldiers over there. We better stay away for now. Yeah, gone from a collect, a, you know, a republic where they've been kind of, they've got a council making, you know, decisions as a collective to just a king who just you know dictatorship basically um and i've got a feeling that it's not it's actually going to be gongora that's that's kind of making the decisions what? uh, what's going on yeah we outcasts now Ow, that all right <laughs> hey who threw that what the hey it's you you're the orange spies Damn it. Spies? We've Thanks, got nothing Jensen. to do with this. Here's your spy. <laughs> yeah, what? Hey, don't point <laughs> your finger at me. Ura's gonna attack Numara, isn't it? It's all your fault! I definitely think we're spies now. We'll, we'll be arrested if this keeps up. Maybe it's better for us to get out of Numara now, Kain. Seconded. They obviously ain't gonna listen to us right now, as we are. How about we leave for now and come up with a plan? That sounds like a plan, but how do we leave? Uh, I guess we could head towards the port. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Well, I may have gone the wrong way. I might have gone the right way. I don't know. I've gone the wrong way compared to what I thought we had. Oh, damn it, I've gone the wrong <laughs> I don't want to go back towards the Queen, that's for sure. I think I want to go this way. I don't know why they insist, by the way, on making all the shops so hidden in this. We'll talk about <laughs> they make their bosses hard, and then it's not even easy to just find a shop. <laughs> you don't like. You know, you gotta right. earn it just to get into a shop. Yeah. What the hell was that, by the way? Is that Ulan attacking Fire. already? They didn't mess about with this. Oh dear. Ulan? This is no ordinary attack, is it? What? What's an ordinary attack? Hmm. Cook, Mac, 
Now's the chance for you to slip into the smoke and run. What? Oh no, I need them. Move! If you stay here, you'll be in our way. And um, that's not true. We're in this together. Let's go. Look. Don't worry. We'll be fine. I say we surprise him by running away. <laughs> you. Shut up. What? <laughs> it really isn't true. They won't be in the way. I need them. <laughs> Come back. Time. See you later. Damn it. Back down to three members. Three members and fighting an army. Sounds fun. You know, I think they've noticed us. Kind. Hmm? If we put up a struggle here, we could end up triggering outright war between Ura and Numara. So uh, that means we should do what? And us all soon. Don't move! If you resist, you'll regret it. I can't fight so them, we, we let ourselves get caught. Uh, that, that's brilliant! <laughs> We should let them know fighting won't solve anything. Then we'll need the power of the queen. Power of the queen. Good idea. You know me and the queen are tight. Yeah, we go way back. No problem. Yeah, right. You're wise you to surrender, spies. We're not spies. We want to speak to the proper authorities. Bum, bum, ba, da, dum. Well, the Queen seems to quite like us, ish. Although her right hand man doesn't, I don't think. The man with the wings. If you're not spies, then what is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of what? Hmm. For ordinary travelers, you've certainly managed to get involved in some extraordinary events. He's big, isn't he? I apologize for Jesus. pretending to be something I'm not. I just want you to hear me out. Oh, I'll hear you out. You're going to tell me what Ura is plotting. Well, see, now there's no surprise. They were going to throw your birthday party. Mm -hmm. Where's the queen? That's going to hurt. Who do you think you're talking to? <sighs> Idiot. What's that look for? Why is wise to call him an idiot. <laughs> what the hell are you wearing? This fellow senses something unusual in your eyes. What? Huh? Well then, let's expose those eyes for what they really are. Our country's sorcerers have some impressive powers themselves. I am Flatter General. Do it. Yes, sir. Gonna find out the truth about Jansen. Or at least, as you know, what kind of hold oh, going go the house over Because I don't think. God, wow, I, do you see mm, what I'm seeing? I don't I'm, think he even knows. Are those mine? Those are mine. Ah. They're mine? Oh. These are without doubt crystals of magic energy. What this man sees is passed along to another sorcerer through these lenses of light. They're called spy eyes. <laughs> They allow a sorcerer to see everything the wearer sees. So Gongora could see everything. Awfully elaborate stunt to pull. Even for a spy. Hey, you know, I had no I am not that smart. I mean, I'm not saying I'm dumb. I just I didn't know. Excuse me, General. But this man is most likely telling the truth. What? The person in which spy eyes are implanted would not be aware of them. I could tell that much when I remove them. This is high-level magic, far beyond the capabilities of someone such as myself. Even with your power, you could not do it? As you say, sir. Ah, I can't believe I... They're he was just using Building me. up how much of a All beast the time to figure is. that out. I am going to make that greedy, senile, flea-infested bastard pay! Huh. You won't have time for that, spies. Hey! We didn't do anything. Kill them. Well... <sighs> Alright then! There was just no getting through to that guy. Hmm? We don't have much of a choice. Is this going to be another boss fight that's really painful? 
we got we got off light last episode and it was the first time I've recorded where there was like no rage involved at all. I just it was pretty plain sailing. Something tells me this isn't gonna be the case. Front row, front row, front row. Okay, so we got four guys. Uh, no particular element. And yeah. Okay. Let's now let's do let's go with physical attacks. And then Um let's do a shield? Physical I, I assume they're gonna do physical attacks. They seem like the type who'll do physical attacks. So let's get a shield on the go. Please not be cruel, game. Oh, no, okay, two, two shots. I was kind of hoping that two hits might be enough to kill one. No such luck. Right, boom, we got a shield on the go, and then we're gonna do a Zephyr next turn and continue attacking. Here we go. Two attacks to the Zephyr, coming right up. Please let this kill him. Okay, boom, okay, so three attacks is enough to kill one. The only worry is, that um, this is just to kill it, like right now I'm only fighting four of them I've got a funny feeling that as soon as I kill these four because you can see behind them there's an army of them I'm gonna kill these four and then another four are gonna just line up straight after them I reckon bad oh 300, we don't usually do that much. 250, boom. Hey, we, we're not counter-attacking, by the way, I must say. I've got counter, I know it's not a, I, well, I say it's not, I, I assume it's not a 100% success rate, but you'd think we'd have done it once by now. I'm just gonna carry on with this foolproof method. Attack, attack, Zephyr. It is a bit heavy on the magic points for Jansen, but Fingers crossed we can get through this fight, doing it this way, and then, um, and then he can just get them topped up at, a, you know, a resting in, a, in a, resting at an inn or something. Um, um, I don't think I'm gonna do it again this time though. Uh, let's go for just, yeah, let's just heal Kai, actually. Da -da. Die, you beast! Boom. Get down. Only the yes, that was it. It was the end of the fight. My god. Finally, the game is not... Ah, hang on. <laughs> Wait for it. I was going to say, finally, the game is not being... ...horrendously brutal. Is this like Cook and Mac coming to the rescue or something? What the hell? What on it? <laughs> Are those your moms? Oh, 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 what the hell is going on here? Hey! Hey! Come back here! Who did this? It was! I was Sorry right! To keep you waiting. Come on. Mac? Skills. Hey, where'd you guys come from? It was fun coming up here. <laughs> we ended up sneaking around like thieves. <laughs> yeah. You did great. Let's go. Alright. Who, right. <laughs> Who knew it? That was the way to beat the guards, just take their clothes off. What? Don't let them escape! Release the guard beast! Oh, oh dear! <laughs> Get out of there! Um. Oh god, they got beasts! Oh, oh! But can I? I wanna. I wanna. No! That's the. Uh, that's the thing, isn't it? Like, if you wanna collect the items, you're gonna get caught by the beasts. If you wanna run for it, you'll be fine. But you, God knows what you might miss out on. 
Right, at least we've got the whole crew back together again. That is nice. Okay, does anyone have a particular element? No, they do not. What the hell are you? God, Prishon. All right, let's take out the beast first. I've got a, f I've got a vague memory. We did fight one of these before, and I've got a vague memory that he did. He does this like rush, like charge attack that does a nasty amount of damage. So let's kill him as quick as possible. Ow. Okay, that was pretty tame. Ow. Order! Oh no. Oh, okay. So yeah. It's, I guess the the way okay, so they're working as a team. If I can so I need them I need them to not work as a team. I need some of them to be dead. Is the uh the short of it. Ba -ba -da -bum, ba -ba -da -bum. Okay, let's go. Is he in the back row? Yeah, he is in the back row. Okay, well let's let's just go for this pression thing. Fire on you. You need to heal up your granddad, and you can do. Ah, let's just do fire. Ba -da -ba. This should be enough to kill this enemy. You would think. We've got four attacks all going in on. Bum, bum, bum. I mean, the GC. Yeah, in fact, it must be. You can see that their GC is almost gone. And the GC is basically the combined health of all the front row. And he's the only thing left in the front row. So therefore, he must be nearly dead. And he was. And he is now. And what is that thing next to Jansen? What? Right, right to the right hand side of Jansen's magic points, there's a glowing black circle thing. Does anyone know what that is? I mean, I'm all for figuring certain stuff out myself, but not when the game just point. Oh, okay, it tells me there. He's blind. He's blind. That's a bit annoying. Um, although not the end of the world for a mage, because I assume it works the same as other games. Um, blind, you know, the, it's like blindness prevents you landing a hit with um, physical attacks, whereas silence prevents you using magical attacks and he doesn't do physical attacks anyway so it really doesn't matter if he's blind I do want to kind of keep getting the oh do we go this way say later boys I'm getting out of here something tells me that's not the last of the gods I'm just gonna probe your uh your vase. Is this it? I mean, what's the goal here? Are we, are we trying to get to the queen or to get her help? What are you doing? We're going to get caught. Sorry. Oh, I see where we're going. We're trying to get to that save point, which is like the very bottom of the map, I'm guessing. Oh, I'm so happy I didn't skip that. Slot seeds are like gold dust. Oh, see that little... Uh, See the little faint, and then I went round him. See you later, doggo. Oh, okay, fine. Oh, got round him like a boss. Uh, see you later, buddy. These guys are amateurs. They're not even putting up a fight to try and uh, catch me. Three mysterious perfumes. Lovely. Oh, and a chest. Bam. Power drink. I am. I've been reserved. What the hell? Okay. Maybe I need to. Um, maybe there's like a lift on the other side, on the downstairs, if you know what I mean. Oh God. Watch this. Watch this. Oh yeah. See you later, buddy. Left him for dead. Oh what? Oh man. Oh. Cheeky little. Oh. Hey. Go away, doggo. I can outrun a dog. What the hell? Where do I go? Uh, this way? No, but it's a chest. 
We're probably going to get into a fight now, but it was worth it for the Cubic Music Score 3. I guess I'm going to have to go back up. I don't know where I'm going. It seems like there's barriers at every turn downstairs and barriers at every turn upstairs. Maybe I need to... No, it didn't let me go in here, did it? Yeah, yeah, all right, Jansen. Usually Jansen's not the, the one. To oh, there's a lift there. I'll oh, get up. I just spotted another lift. Um, Jansen's not usually the one to be sensible. He's, he's usually like, yeah, go on, let's have a little check. Check it out. Let's have a little party. Okay. Oh, right. Right. All in the front row. Okay, that's pretty good. Smash that. Smash that. You're gonna heal yourself. Cook is gonna hurt someone. And, um, let's do some wind. I don't know. It's as good as any. And you're definitely gonna do shadow because there's three enemies. Ta-da! Oh, what? That is scandalous. That is out. Hey, but Mac dodged and then countered. It's like the ultimate. Couldn't have went any better. Dodged it, but still did the counter attack. Yes. Take that, you filthy beast. Ooh. What the hell is up with these guys? Are they like. They think they're a ghost or something. Shadow! That shadow is a really nice move, isn't it? There we go, there we go. Fire. Let's do water, why not? And let's do shadow. This should be enough to... Oh, I've messed it up. This should be enough to finish it off. I, you know, I, I've got to say, I thought the rings... May, maybe I'm not kind of... Maybe I'm not making the most of them. But I, I felt like... I thought... I just assumed early on in the game that the rings would maybe be a bigger... Would have a bigger impact than I think they seem to be making for me. Um, ah, screw it. Let's just go all out. Um, I'm sure we can finish them off. Ah, oh, we can't finish them off when we miss. Ah, oh, what? <laughs> Absolutely outrageous. Um, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I just figured the rings would have a bigger impact, but they don't seem to. Like as it is, I think. We've got one ring that, like, increases the ch like, has a small chance of, um, poisoning the enemy, and yet seems to work, like, 0% of the time. Then we've got rings that increase your physical attack, uh, but they increase it by, like, 1% or something. I don't know, it's barely even noticeable. Um, I mean, Seth has got one that adds fire damage, which is good when you're... It's good when you're fighting someone that does fire. It, that's weak to f Come on, seriously. There we go. It's good when you're fighting someone that's weak to fire, but other than that, meh. But I, I suppose, obviously, those kind of things you can switch around if you know that a boss is weak to fire and you've died the first time, then next time you could you could make sure that Seth and Kaim have both got a fire ring. But yeah, I don't know. I, I thought it would make a. I thought it would just be a, a bigger thing. Oi! Sneak past the old doggo. Thank you. Black pearl, something. And I can't stay to. Do you know what? Actually, I can stay because I want to go. <laughs> want to see what the other stuff is. And it seems like the uh, enemies are so easy to dodge that. It's not even, you know. Oh no, I don't think I'm getting out of this one. Adept earrings. Oh, maybe I am getting out of it. Too slow. See you later, buddies. I'm gonna check out those adept earrings when the kind of the panic of this is over. I think this is probably gonna be the last bit, like, cause now we're like the we're now like the other side of the fence, aren't we? So we now I can reach that save point. I think. Healing potion. Oh god. Oh, hey, doggo. Right, grab this. Oh no, there's two of them. I'm not getting out of this. <laughs> no. Right, I'm gonna fight these and then we'll carry on. Boom, there we go. And we just finished that fight and 
he's just learned level 3 magic, uh, spirit magic. Increases the speed of a party member or decreases the speed of an enemy. That's quite useful. Alright, let's go get this chest. Oh no! There's not a chest down there. Outrageous. Okay, we can get this though. For some reason, that dog doesn't want to follow him anymore. Oh, Angel's Plume, that is a Phoenix Down. I'll forever call it that. <laughs> Sorry. Right, oh, hello. Chance to the top of my health and a save point. Do you know what that means? I'm going to bet that there's a boss in about three seconds. Let me save it. Right, here we go. Let's face a boss, I assume. No way they're giving me a full health top up and a save point without giving without throwing a boss up. Let's hope it's as kind as the last one. Hmm. Whew. Yeah, this is much better. Time to relax. Yeah. You all right? Yeah. So no way it's staying like this. Uh, Mac. Uh. Okay. I'm so tired, Cook. This is gonna be like Queen's bedroom, isn't it? Oh, hello. <laughs> Ant-Ming? What? Jensen? <sighs> Please, don't get up. <laughs> Why have you come? Oh, you're all... You don't remember me? I'm Seth. Seth Balmore. This is Kai Marganar. We're comrades. Remember? Comrades? What do you mean by that? Here, let me... She had air memory right as well. Here we go. <laughs> He's got his clothes back on. End of the line for you. Your Majesty, I'm terribly sorry for the trouble. It will be over. Just a moment. Sorry, this will be over in a second. Hey, Squeaky, don't care about the Queen's continued good health, huh? Huh? <sighs> you! Get out of the way! You do anything funny and the Queen gets it. <laughs> Figurehead or not, she's still the queen, Tiny. If anything happens to her, you'll be held responsible. You know better than to try anything, right? I mean, you're not stupid. <laughs> you're a real thug. You know that, Jansen? <laughs> There's an exit in the back. Huh? Behind us. Jansen, keep it up. Fall back. Right. <laughs> Don't move. See, occasionally, occasionally, Jansen uh, comes good in his own way. You get it? Don't move from that spot. You swine! <laughs> no. See you later, Baldy. No matter, Palace facade. Does he even does he not even know about that and exit or what? I don't know, but I'm gonna cheek grab a cheeky little vase. Hundred gold. Thank you very much. Where the hell Oh, might as well grab this one. And there's some little girl or something there. It's such a mixed bag of what you can excuse me. Okay, I don't seem to be able to get that one. It's an empty vase. Oh, she got a cat! Animal adoring Rona. This can't be happening. Where could my Moo have, go have gone? My dog Moo went off somewhere all of a sudden and it still hasn't come back. He probably got lost while he was out looking for food again. He's such a pig sometimes. I can usually find him around here, but not today. I doubt he's left town though. Am I supposed to try and help her find her dog? Oh, hello. 
What are you doing here? You can forget about getting into the palace. I don't want to. I want to get out the palace. Enjoy your freedom while you can. The queen will pass judgment on you soon enough. Well, I think you'll find... Actually, is she with us? Okay, she's not, like, with us as a team member. That would have been cool. Hey, stop goofing around. They're going to catch up to us. I'm not trying to goof around, buddy. Do, 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 do. It's twice in one game, we're barely into the... <laughs> we're only about eight hours into the game, and twice already we've kidnapped a queen. Oh dear. Is this the boss fight that they were building us up to? General Kakanas. You won't get away this time, because you're all under arrest on suspicion of spying and for abducting Her Majesty the Queen. The Queen's right next you to them. Come along quite Lower that cannon. Okay, this is the boss fight I was talking about, uh, that I thought was coming. Thought we'd managed to dodge it. Should have known better. Right, okay, here we go. One step at a time. He's got a magic heavy tank. We fought a, a magic tank right at the start of the game as the tutorial. He's got a magic heavy tank, the cannon, the tank unit, and the cannon unit. All of which are non-elemental and all of which are in the front row. I assume it would be wise to take out... I don't know, actually, the magic... Take out the heavy tank, maybe? See, he's got two bars there charging, like... Um, like the worm, I assume. Like, they're gonna go charge, 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 big attack. Um, okay, let's just... Uh, let's... Pick, a, pick something and go for it. So we're picking a magic heavy tank. Um, and we're just going to put all of our power into that. Can't poison it because it's a, you know, it's a machine. We could... Right, we're going to increase our physical defense. Because there's less points increasing our magical defense because we're going to get rid of that magical cannon very quickly. Hopefully. Um, okay. Do, do. Turns one part. Uh, this is the thing that I don't know. Turns one party member into a Kellalon or removes Kellalon status. A Kellalon's that little weird thing, isn't it? With a hat on. Why would the hell would you want to. She's pulling tongues at them. Um, why would I want to turn it into a Kellalon? I don't know. I, I don't want to. I don't know, maybe maybe there's something I'm missing. Right. Ooh, we could speed someone up, couldn't we? Or slow the enemy. Or increase the magical attack of a party. Oh, okay. Hmm. Okay, let's increase the physical attack of Kaim. Do, do, do. How dare you! He's stealing Jansen's magic points! Uh, 99 Flare Okay, that's doing more than their physical attacks So maybe I should, I don't know Maybe I should focus on increasing the magic attack of the mages Instead of the physical attack of the physicals Okay, so that's done And I guess now that I've, oh god Can I, I can't do anything here, no Going for set. Oh, okay, that was pretty tame. Although we have got a barrier. No, oh, okay. I was going to say, although we have got a barrier on, so maybe that's why it was tame, but we haven't. We've only just put it on. Um, okay, I guess now that we've made Kaim stronger, it makes sense to also speed him up as well. Because then he's faster. You know, it's like a double whammy. Um, we will black magic. The heavy tank? Just, just keep going for that. And... Actually, do you know what? I think she's going to do a Zephyr. Because... Oh, what are these again? Reduces the spell casting time for one party member. Reduces the spell casting time of the user. Which covers HP of one party member. Hmm. 
No, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go stick with my Zephyr just to be on the safe side, play cautious. And what was that I wanted to do? I wanted to Oh yeah, I wanna speed up Kaim. Because then he'll be extra strong and extra fast. So Yeah, sounds good. Cannon charge! Don't like the uh Cannon power and the tank power both charging up. Makes me think I maybe should have targeted one of those things first and took that out of action. Vol cannon. This is actually pretty weak though, I mean. So this isn't really much of a worry. The worry is the things that are charging up right now. Cause just because they're unknown, so I have no idea what kind of damage they could do. Party's GC has been reduced. Outrageous. Oh, okay. Even though I can heal up, it my I think the level of my GC has been reduced. I'm not quite sure. Um, actually, hang on a minute. This isn't. This is a. This is a turn-based game, rather than an ATB game. So what? Oh man. So I don't think increasing the speed is actually gonna make much of a difference. I mean it must make a difference, I guess, because they've built they've made it a mechanic. But normally if this was like an ATB game, it would mean that your turn comes around faster. But Kaim is still gonna get his t one turn per Well you calm down. <laughs> um is still gonna get his one turn per turn, if you know what I mean. Like so Let's go shadow. Well, we could slow... No, actually, we'll just do shadow. Attack everything. Probably should have been doing that from the start, to be honest. He could be attacking four things all at once. Seems like a no-brainer, really. Um, yeah, so it's not... I don't know. It's not... It doesn't seem like it's going to make much of a difference, actually. But, I mean, it probably means he gets his turn faster, but... So what? Like... <laughs> Like, I mean, as in, like, he acts faster than other things, but it's like, I don't know, is that, that, it's not that big a deal. Um, it might be a bigger deal to maybe, if you had a healer. If you had a healer, then you might really want them to attack first. Um, or, so, or rather, to have their turn first, because then they could get their heals in, in time. I don't like that at all. Lowering my GC. Have some shadow in your face. Okay, so... This magic heavy tank ain't going down, is it? I hope they have a... I, maybe, ho I hope that I've picked on the bit that's got the most health. And they haven't all got this much health, because Jesus. Right, another Zephyr, please. And another... Shadow. Maybe, maybe I've just picked on the worst bit to start with. God, I'm glad I've done a Zephyr, that's all I can say, because we're getting both barrels here, the cannon power and the tank power. I think I've just taken out that top bit, though. Okay, so that... I'm guessing that stops the thing where he reverses and then rams into us, because he can't move now. Oh, no, he can move. Don't know what's that done. Okay, this is a full charge cannon. Oh, man, that was bad. Thank God for the Zephyr. <laughs> um, yeah, that was really bad. Um, we are down. Oh, we took out two there. We took out the tank cannon. Oh, that's weird. So by taking out the heavy thing, we took out two? So do we take out the cannon or the cannon unit? Um, I suppose take out the cannon? Because then it doesn't matter if... Like, what? it doesn't matter. I think the cannon, cannon unit, I think, is what's charging it. But if the cannon's dead, then it doesn't matter if it's charged. It's dead. Um, that's my theory. Okay. You are gonna do an angel's plume on Mac, and you are gonna do another Zephyr, just to get everyone 
sorted. Bum, 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 bum. But I gotta say, I think this is going pretty well. I, I, again, I don't want to jinx myself, but I think, I think this might be two bosses in a row that we're gonna kill without dying. That'll be some skills if we do. I'll be very happy. Alright, so this is gonna nearly kill Mac, but he's gonna survive it, and then Cook's gonna do a Zephyr to get him back in the game. You know, Zeph like you really feel the benefit of Zephyr when there's um when there's five people in the team. When there's like you know, when there's only three and it's kind of like um and some of them maybe don't even need healing. You don't feel the benefits of it so much. But when when you've got um you know, when you've got five people who are all hurt, it feels so good. <laughs> feels so good to get them all healed all at once. Perfect. Perfect. Oh yeah. I'm so glad I increased the uh, Kaim's attack damage. He's really piling on the damage now. I should probably do it to Seth as well, to be honest. I think that's what I'll do next turn if we don't need to heal. Fine, because we got a Zephyr coming in. No, we haven't. We got a Shadow coming in. Okay, whatever. <laughs> do, 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 do. It's fine. It's fine. So we're gonna go attack, attack, fire, um, Zephyr, and you're gonna increase the power of Seth. This is too easy. Too easy. <laughs> I'm, ki I'm kidding. But yeah, it's it's nah, it's a refreshing break. I mean, I, I have, I am, I'm sure they'll put, you know, there'll there'll be more hard bosses to come. I'm sure they're not all going to be like this on the last one. But it's a nice, it's a nice break from spending like an hour having, you know, spending an hour and ten attempts on every single boss. It's uh, it's nice. Zephyr! And everyone's actually fully healed now, thanks to that. So we can just go all out attack this turn. All out attack! Open fire! Um, we'll go with Shadow, actually. Might as well attack the cannon unit while we're there. Oh, here we go. We're getting the full... Oh dear, I was going to say we're getting the full attack now from the big cannon, but it looks like we're not, because it looks like it's dead. <laughs> Get out, winghead. Mysterious perfume, lovely. Kaim land power hit, Seth land combo, Jansen land absorb transfer. I have no idea what that is. Sounds interesting. Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba 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 No, oh. he's not giving up yet. Oh, or not? Yes. Right. Hmm. You had that coming. Why don't you just go back to bed? And start the day over. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Fire! Shoot them! I gotta say, sometimes the music in this, like the music, drowns out the voices a lot. Um. Sometimes they really should have like the voices a little bit louder or the music a little bit quieter. Whatever. Oh dear. Come on, Queen. I mean, she needs to ditch him anyway, because um, you know, he 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 basically just said, you know, I don't care if you're the queen, I'm gonna do whatever I want, kind of thing. So. She doesn't want to be hanging around with him anymore. Jansen will be happy to have her around. Yeah, sorry about that uh, thing back there. Well, he said he, he said it wasn't well, real. I didn't want to pull a stunt like that. But hmm. Listen, did I hurt you? I, I'm sorry if I did. I didn't mean it. Oh. It's fine. Everyone is safe now, after all. Well, you know, I should really be thanking you for helping us escape. 
Well, since these children were there. You're acting kind of weird. You got a crush. Would you shut up? We had a moment there. <laughs> Aunt Ming, are you okay? Yes. I don't get why they call that Aunt Ming. Mac, why are you two? Did something happen to your mother? She's just a family Master. friend, or? Please don't let your spirits fall. I'll always be with you. Thank you, Aunt Ming. It's probably me forgetting something. It's probably like. Oh, why would a big boy like you be crying, Mac? He's going to change from here on out. Seth. Hmm? What you said earlier, that we were friends, is it true? Yeah, but this isn't the best place to stop and talk about it. We need <laughs> to get out of town. What will you do, Your Highness? You said earlier you couldn't leave because you were the Queen. I'll go with you. It seems I must. You'll come with us? Yes. Awesome. Hmm. Right. Didn't they mention that she was an immortal? I'm sure they said there was, they said there was only. I'm sure they said something like you know there's only three immortals: Seth, Time, and the Queen. In Hold which on. case, she might join We're our team. We're being pursued by both Numara and Gungora. We should probably find a ride. Ride? Where? How? Let's go to the harbor. I've got an idea. Okay. View the composite magic tutorial? Uh, yes, please. Some magic spells can be combined together to form what is known as composite magic. Ah, so all flare. Thank God for that. I was wondering, like, are we ever going to get a chance to be able to do, like, certain spells or, like, you know, across everyone else? Or if they were just going to give certain, like, multicast spells like Zephyr and whatever. To cast the composite magic, you must be able to use both of the spells that compose it. Use the spell book under menu to check the spells required for composite magic. Any composite magic for which you lack the required spells will not be displayed. You can only use composite magic spells for which you have the required skill level. No, I don't. Okay. That seems pretty straightforward. Easy enough. To get. Do, 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 do. To the port of Numara. To get the queen out of here. I love that little, like, pan pipes thing. Shipyards up ahead, that's where the latest model's being built. You should go take a look. We should, but not before I save it. And I'm afraid we are going to leave the episode there for today because we've. It's. I think I don't know what it's going to be after the t after it's been cut down a little bit, but it already feels like it's another big one by accident. But it is what it is. We did another boss. We did it first time. We're cruising now. The game is so easy. I'm, <laughs> I'm joking, but yeah, it's going good now. I'm I'm, I'm really enjoying it. It's been a bit more chill the last couple of episodes. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Up. Hang on. <clears throat> I'm gonna do that again. <clears throat>